the owner of Ife is currently furious. Yes, he is seriously furious at the fact that Olorito Phillips have, you know, disrespected him over time. And as he stands, he is no longer finding it likely again. Yes, he is not finding it likely again. Because if you'd want to look very critical into the whole condition of things, Toby Phillips have taken authority into her hands. The moment they said Toby Phillips was pregnant, Toby is returning back into the palace, Toby is doing this, Toby is doing that, Toby became quite loose. The Toby Phillips that back then we used to say, ah, Toby you know they talk, Toby doesn't do this, Toby doesn't do that. She's just there seeking for attention, seeking for codos, seeking for all of those things. It is far beyond that. Toby now wants far, far more than that. And now that Toby wants more than that, it's beginning to be alarming. Toby wants authority. Toby wants every single thing that she can control. And this, her quest for control, is beginning to be disrespectful both to the Oni and Olori Naomi in general. If you have been following this matter very, very careful, if you have been following it so well, and if you have been looking into it on a very very um considerable note you would discover that in the whole of this thing we are we have been been on in the past times you discover that toby phillips have changed over time now what has toby done if you could remember there was a time toby returned back into the palace on a request of olori naomi olori naomi wanted her around that was when it became like olori naomi was the hot cake and the person they wanted in the palace so bad the only said she was the one he wanted she should come back even till now now she only wants that one all of us take no yes say now she only still want so so from that period only she started returning back into the palace despite she has announced her wedding she said she was involved with another man only was not caring enough he was not giving her all the attention she deserves and you know all of those things put together then she came back into the palace toby had her twins and boom today toby has the full authority in the palace she she makes declarations she speaks he does this so olori naomi has been in ilay for, for a few days now and according to her she's doing some community service development works of which they are going rounds they are creating rounds on the internet so toby had to go all the way to ilay to go challenge olori naomi's authority if naomi says this should be done toby had to go all the way to ilay to Go tell the people that if Olori Naomi says this, don't do it. Hmm. The only is not finding it funny. Yes, he's not finding any of this activity funny at all as he's currently furious at Toby Phillips for her actions. In as much as Toby might feel that she is okay, she's the one now in charge because Naomi is not there in the palace. She now automatically has twins for the king. And it's more like it's who has a child that becomes the one in authority because when Ronke had the privilege to speak to Naomi, she made a statement that you are lucky because you have a male child for the king. So that's what what that's what's giving you the leverage, the authority, every single thing that you have been doing. Not knowing that what exists between Olui Naomi and the king, there is a connection that nobody can separate. It is a connection that it is there. Nobody can separate it. Nobody can come in between and just say that this thing has to scatter. It is not possible. It is not possible. It cannot even exist. It cannot even happen at all. That is the most impossible thing that will happen in this world. The relationship between... Um, Olori Naomi and the king. You see how when Naomi was still in her house, uh, the king would go there from time to time over and over trying to bring her back. It was more like an activity for him. It was more like something he was doing with all his life because he loves Olori Naomi. He loves her and he badly wants her back. So my people right now know that is what... Toby Phillips is doing. Toby Phillips is questioning each and every authority Olori Naomi has placed out there. He, she's questioning every single thing that Olori Naomi has to say. And Olori Naomi presently in Ileife doing her thing. No, Toby Phillips is stomping in, coming in to challenge her to make sure that whatsoever Olori Naomi, Olori Naomi has does not come to does do, does not come to pass so my people right now this matter it come heavy yes it come heavy and if you want to agree with me and you go agree with me 
you go agree with me say um this whole matter you don't they reach a point the way these women they are deliberately daring naomi they are de- it's beginning to be deliberate they are deliberately making it look like like ugh, who are you do whatsoever you want to do yes they are making it a deliberate attempt to dare her so right now the whole thing it's more like women just want to see the worst naomi can do they want to see what she is capable of what she's made up of or whatsoever she feels she can actually do and as it stands i'm not sure oliri naomi is ready or is set for all of these things yes Yes, she's, she, she, she's not ready for all of these things. Because if you want to look at it very critical, the way Naomi keeps avoiding chaos, the way she keeps avoiding all these bus boats, the way she keeps avoiding all this wahala, all this uh, palace, palava, and all of these things, it is it is it's such a sign that she doesn't want any single thing at all. She doesn't want anything that will cause chaos for her, that will cause any form of trouble at all but right now no you know can't be the same thing where all these other only ones yes you know can't be the same thing where them want so them they are fighting so hard they're trying every single thing possible they are doing every single thing within their power to make sure that what they bring naomi out of that shelf she's hiding because they feel she's pretending but it's been over years it's been years someone that left the palace in december 2020 this is 2024 that's automatically four years three years there about so for how long is she going to pretend for how long is she going to to play this 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 pretense they are assuming she's pretending i don't know some people can pretend for their entire life but i doubt if naomi is actually pretending i doubt if naomi is pretending so right now they are telling they are trying to you know bring her out and toby phillips questioning naomi's authority openly publicly has just shown the high rate of disunity which have existed between all of this olori in the palace over time and then if you could remember what the only spiritual wife had to to tell these women you told them that they have disrespected their husband it is not enough for them they have chosen to what disrespect the whole community inclusive so right now no right now my people now so the matter can't it be and the way this matter they go now you know go one miss out on any single thing at all so if you never subscribe please hit the subscribe button yes please hit the subscribe button and as you subscribe you see that bell way there by the side just ring up anytime way anything fresh something good something nice happens to come at least you'll be the first to see it so just hit the subscribe button and ring the bell by the side expecting exciting a great news on this channel